the Alka field days uh, and, and how that started. You were involved in that and that has become a, a major, major event. Tell us uh, how that happened. Field days just happened. And this kind of developed as a challenge between Roy, uh, Roy Mecklenburg and Ron Smith and Bob Calloway in Michigan State and Ohio State and Mississippi State were going to play it off to see who had the better students. And Mississippi State was chosen because it was in the South and we could do it in spring. And uh, I said, look, we ought to legitimize this and at least invite a couple of industry people here to act as judges. And so I got in touch with some people. I said, do you think you could send a couple of people down here to serve as judges? And uh, 18 industry people showed up at the first Alpha Field Day. Student Career Days event overall has been a huge part of who I've become in the industry. For me this event uh, really kind of helped my career out. It, it defined kind of the, um, the successes that you can have in this field. I, just, I scored fourth in trencher operation which was another big deal for me. Uh, I still distinctly remember my first event and just it was the opening ceremony and watching all of these students and the excitement and the cheers and then firing off into all of these different competitions and then starting to realize that this was so much more. I don't know of any industry that does something like this. And for these students to have the opportunity to not only compete against their peers and to learn from their peers and some of the other uh, professors and so forth, but to be side by side with the industry, working hands on with these folks, learning directly from them, and most importantly, making that connection and having that network opportunity. There's nothing like it. Yeah, I think this, this competition and this event really gives our students an eye-opening experience. Gain, every year I come, I meet more people, um, gain more experiences, and um, just, so yeah, the networking, um, just getting to experience a different part of the country. Being from Kansas, it's a lot different landscape than some of the southern states I've got to visit, so just all around a great experience. I was really excited to see so many people who are passionate about landscaping and horticulture all in one place, and just to see how everyone became interested in it and working together to just put together um, great outdoor displays and just seeing all different areas of landscaping. It was amazing how many people were, were actively looking for jobs and actively looking for placement. And so it was, a, it was a good opportunity for us to get in front of some real young minds. Whether it was 40 years ago or today, the students that come are jazzed up and excited about this event. They're excited to compete, they're excited to meet um, opportunities for, for employment or for internships, and to me, that is amazing. I mean, it's a blast. You, there's no better way to build teamwork than out here. I mean, you know, like you can see today, there's a lot of adversity to overcome, and it just makes teamwork that much more fun. Coming to the National Collegiate Landscape Competition, you see the future of the landscape industry. And that is so important to us, to invest in it now. And more importantly, to have the students see that we as industry suppliers, as corporations, believe in them and are willing to invest not only money, but time and effort in their future.